Today, I'm gonna to show you how I do way less than the average agent and make way more money. And this is because I have a really high conversion rate. This is exactly how I set listing appointments like that, close the seller at the appointment. In fact, in the last five days, I took, uh, I got two listing agreements signed, all from cold leads on the very first contact of a circle prospecting call. Like no follow-up involved. I just set the appointment straight off that first call. And I've been teaching agents how to do this for the last few years. And in fact, in one year, me and my agents took over a hundred listings using exactly what I'm about to show you. So if you want to be able to get 10 X the results from doing the same amount of work you're currently doing, watch the entire video. This is going to be a tale between two agents, beta Joe and high converting Chad. I'm going to show you why it's bad to be beta Joe and why you want to be high converting Chad. And I'm going to show you how to be a high converting Chad. So let's start with beta Joe, beta Joe to get one listing. Beta Joe needs to go on 10 listing appointments because maybe Beta Joe doesn't really have a great, great uh, listing presentation. He's not good at getting the seller to want to work with him. But for Beta Joe to get a listing appointment, let's say he's dialing expired leads and he needs to contact 50 expired leads to get one appointment, one listing appointment. Meaning he needs to have 50 conversations with 50 expireds to get an appointment. That sucks. It sucks, but it's the reality for most agents. In order for Beta Joe to get 10 appointments, he needs to have 500 expired contacts to get 10 appointments, which ultimately means in order for Beta Joe to get one listing, he needs to hit 500 expired contacts. And that would drive me insane. Now let's break down high converting Chad's numbers, all right? In order for a high converting Chad to get one listing, he only needs to go on four appointments. So immediately his conversion rate is more than double. And for Chad to get one appointment, he only needs to have eight contacts with expired leads. So instead of talking to 50 expired leads, Joe only needs to talk to eight. And if that's the case, in order for Chad to get four appointments, he only needs 32 expired contacts, which ultimately means one listing can be achieved with 32 contacts. What a difference that is for Beta Joe and high converting Chad. Now let me break this down even further and this is where it's gonna hurt. So one listing, let's say it's worth $500,000 and of course because we're listing agents we control the commission amount and one listing is worth $15,000. For Beta Joe to hit 500 contacts would give him one listing which would equal $15,000. But for high converting Chad, that same 500 contacts that Joe would be having, for Chad with his high conversion rate, from the same 500 contacts that it takes for Joe to get a listing, for 500, con 500 of the same contacts for Chad equals 15 listings, which means Chad is making a quarter mil off all those contacts. Now, who do you want to be? Do you want to be Beta Joe that has to do a billion times the amount of work to get 15 grand or do that same amount of work and get a quarter mil? This is why I talk so much about conversion rate all the time. It's, it's not a good and efficient strategy to just hope that you're gonna get a listing one day. You wanna track all your numbers and see what your conversion rate is so that you can aim to get better at this. The truth is, high converting Chad's conversion rates, those are my conversion rates. I have to do way less work than the average agent and I want you to ask yourself, how many people, how many appointments do you need to go on to take a listing? How many people do you need to talk to to set a listing appointment? Do you not even know how many? You're just banking on luck? You're just hoping that one day you're gonna set a listing appointment out of luck? You cannot run a business when you're operating on luck. This is how me and my agents took over 100 listings in one year. This is how Jason over in Orange County took 25 listings in his first 90 days working with me, cold calling. This is exactly how John in Houston, Texas is on track to take 50 listings his first year of cold calling. If you're ready to work directly with me to learn exactly how to be like a high converting Chad, click the link below for the accelerator program to book a call with me, but only do this if you're ready. If you are, let's hop on a Zoom call. Let's talk about what this would look like for you and change your life. Let's turn you into high converting Chad.